Hey guys, before this video starts, please check out my other videos, like and subscribe, share my videos to other people so I can get my name out there because we're trying to make it to 100 subscribers. And let's get it on with this intro. Hey guys, it's your boy Malik on Fleet 3.0 back at it again with another video. It's been a while since I saw you guys. Thank you for still being subscribed to me after being away for so long. I mean, I've been seeing you AMVs, but I know y'all just wanted to see my face. So today, we're going to go all the way back to sixth grade for this story. When I try to steal my best friend's girl. If I remember correctly, his name started with a J. So let's just call him J for now. So me and J, we started, um, we were friends. We were best friends actually. And we got along very well, got along very well. And then he told me he liked this girl. The girl was beautiful, I'll, I'll admit that. She was cute. And I've been, I was hyping him up, I said, yeah. Bro, she's beautiful. You can bag that. Just get up there. That's when, like, I had high confidence, but I was short. Like, let me put up one of my WWA videos, and that's exactly how I looked back in the day. Back in sixth grade. Matter of fact, those videos in WWA when I was making them, I was in seventh grade. So just imagine that I was still that height. Let me put it up real quick. Welcome to WWA. Bow down and kiss me feet. From Tacoma, Washington, Linus! Exactly. You see what I'm saying? You see what we're talking about? That's my voice. That's how I look. But I'm still banging girls. Like, <laughs> like, I am still doing it to this day. Hey, just because you're skinny doesn't mean you don't have a thick it is what it is. So, he asked her out. Because I found out that she liked him too. And I'm like, yo, she likes you. You like her. That's easy money right there. Just ask her out. So, they, he asked her out. And I, I'm not even joking with you. The day after they um, started dating. Like, they look like they've been dating for a long time, right? Tell me why. Literally, the day after that. They broke up. <sighs> Yo, I thought that was the funniest thing in my entire life. To this day, I thought that was the funniest thing. Like, I come across my mind, and I'm like, "Yo, that was actually sad." Like, I can't stop laughing about it because she broke up with him because she was moving in three months. If I remember correctly, we started school in September. September, October, November, December. She's leaving in December. She was leaving in December. And she broke up with the dude. And I was making fun of him. I'm like, yo, <laughs> yo, how you <laughs> how you like this girl for a long time and she broke up with you after a day a day and a half? And he's like, oh, it's because of reasons. I'm like, look, if a girl really wants you, she would have stuck out with you until she moved. Like, you know how I many relationships I know that they broke up at least like a month before the person moves or at least when they move never literally three months before they go which I found funny and I made fun of him for like the rest of the year because of that but let's go let's get into the, the meat and potatoes of what happened so me and this girl let's call her uh, Melanie or something because she was Hispanic but Melanie's not a good name Mel let's call her Mel or something so me and Mel, she and I, um, we started talking, we were vibing, like, I swear to you, people thought me and her were dating because of how close we were. And she, you know, you know how you know your friend zone is when, um, when someone's like, oh, are you, uh, 
We all too look like you're dating each other. Nah, nah, nah. We just friends. That's how you know you're friend zone. But this girl, when they said, oh, we're dating, yo, she didn't say nothing. She just smiled and waved. I'm like, hey, hey, you don't know what you, you don't know what you're doing. Cause back then, I mean, I'm still a savage, but back then I was going off hinge. Like there was no rules to me. Like I'll kiss a girl without having a reason. Like I'll like her and she don't like me. I'll still kiss her. Like that, that's how I was rolling back then. But she was like, she didn't say nothing when they said we were dating. I'm like, oh, you know what time it is? You know, free Mrs. Steel girl hashtag it. But um, as time going. It's the time she has is near the time she has to move and me and her are real close this time and Like yo to the point that she don't even hang out with Jay like she still talks about him sometimes But she don't hang out with Jay. I hang out with Jay. She only hangs out with him when she's with me So basically me and her are dating in my mind back in sixth grade because There was no evidence that she didn't like me like she was legit be with me. She was hanging out with me. We sat near each other during class. Um, back then we had like, uh, I think it was like a homeroom kind of thing. We would sit next to each other. Yo, we had assigned seats, bro. And me and her never sat at each other. She would sit here and I'll be over there. But we still uh, found a way to get next to each other. So, me and her, it was time for her to leave. It's the month of December. It's time for her to leave, and we're getting to the buses. And this is how I knew I was this close to Clinton. If she didn't have to move, I would have asked her out. I don't know why I didn't ask her out. Maybe because I didn't want to get what Jay got and get broken up literally a day and a half later. But she said, Yo, um, tell Jay I'm gonna miss him. And I'm gonna miss you too, Malik. And she hugs me, and I hug her, and we sat there for a fat minute. Like, <sighs> Smell like flowers, bro. Like, oh, demon inside of me. He's ready to be unlooped. Let him run. But after that, I never saw her again. Back then, I didn't have like any way to communicate with people. I had a tablet, and I was just getting started with Kick. That's how life went, and that's how I almost stole his girl. I hope you guys watch any other of my videos. I hope you like and subscribe, share my videos with other people so they can like and subscribe. And thank you for the 89 subscribers that have been with me for so long. And hopefully, we make it to 100 because that's my goal for right now. And then we can go up from there. Like and subscribe. Malik on Fleet 3.0 out.